Hello everybody, and welcome to the Roman Baths. I'm going to be giving you a brief tour of this new and, new and improved bath created with the Hypocost system. We're going to be starting at the plesture, where you can come and build up a sweat by wrestling and doing archery. Sweating is supposed to open up your pores, getting you ready for the baths. If you feel you need to go to the restroom at this time, you may go to the area marked and do your needs. After going to the palestra, you will proceed to the tempidarium, which is the cleaning room. Here you will stand on pedestals while slaves clean you by scraping off your dirt, sweat, and grime. While you are being cleaned, you may enjoy a show put on the sh by, the street by, sh by the street performers. After you have built up a sweat and been cleaned, it is time to proceed to the cald caldarium, which is a hot room consisting of a warm bath and some cloth towels for you to lie down and relax. This room is heated by the hypocost system. The hypocost system starts with a fire below the ground, creating hot air, which travels around the area below, being spread out evenly by the pillars, allowing hot air to heat up the ceramic floor and also travel through the bricks in the walls with holes in them. The air goes through there to get to a small hole in the ceiling of the caldarium, allowing some of the air to get out. The excess hair, air, hot air is exited, exited through the chimney. After going to the caldarium, you will proceed to the frigidarium, which is a room consisting of ice, which cools you down and closes your pores. You can get into the cold bath if you wish, or you can proceed to the second palestra, which consists of a small library, many beds for you to nap on, a gourmet food bar, food bar, and many premier art paintings. I hope you enjoyed this tour. Please stop by sometime soon.